Welcome back to Sexified Fallout 4. I'm Rook, and this uh, sexy robot looking girl is Nasty. And we are out here in the middle of nowhere with Nick and Dogmeat. We are heading towards Nordhagen, where, uh, Nord, Nord something. Um, we're, we're heading towards the little marker on our compass because these people need help with dealing with raiders, I think. Um, and so look at, look at that airship. We're going to go there sooner or later, I'm sure. But uh, not today, I guess. But what is this? Do you hear that? Easy City Downs? This race is really heating up. Uh, they're running races? For the devil. Oh, Nick, what are you doing? Get Stop doing that. It's not our objective. Come on, Nick. Oh, my God, all I wanted to do was get the freaking marker, and he starts shooting anything. Oh, it's a raider. Oh, oh my god, we've got we've got lots of raiders on us now. What the hell? Nick, see what you did? What are you doing, man? Alright, this okay, I gotta switch weapons now because that is not gonna cut it. Can I even get a shot on it? No. Let's see, is there anybody else? We can get that turret, I guess. Take I hope. Boys. What? No, it's not that. I love our pit boy background. It's so nice. Um, all right. No, I'm not gonna hit that. We'll try this again. I missed that too. This is not the good spot. We'll just take all of her stuff and leave her in her underwear. What's going on here? Look, if I leave, will Nick just follow me? Good grief! We're get, I'm getting peppered by that turret. I don't know where dog meat went. I do know though that I don't want to deal with that right now. We've got a mission, and Nick. He is a troublemaker. Okay, there's dog meat. Is Nick going to follow us? He's got to be essential because he's a quest NPC at the moment. So, you know, maybe he'll disengage at some point. Good. He's backing up. Come on, Nick. This is... We're not going there. Let him do their freaking bot races. We don't care about that. Um, what we do care about is these poor folk over here. Um, and they they need our help. Did the Minutemen send you? Uh, what's the problem? Yes, I'm here to help. What's the problem? There's a group of raiders that won't leave us alone, stealing our food and supplies, threatening us if we can't give them <laughs> what they want. We know where they're coming from, but we can't stand up to them ourselves. Uh, how many? <laughs> Any idea how many raiders we're talking about? No telling, I'm afraid. This time there were three, but who knows how many are back at their base. So, yeah, if you didn't notice the message, we've got to go back there. We're, we're... Oh, okay, they're coming after us, apparently. There's one... Okay, I'll go for a headshot right about now. Oh, shoot, we missed. What is up? Oh, you? Oops, let's point at the person that we're trying to shoot. This is not the weapon for this, though. 
That is the weapon for that. Okay, what is going on here? Okay, I see a red marker. Is there someone else there? Somebody's shooting at us. Aren't they? I thought I heard, like, a bullet fly by. And we're just going to grab all their stuff because I don't... I don't want to deal with sorting through it at the moment. I had... I was at, like, 116 out of 260 or something, weight-wise. Uh, okay, well, it went green. The little red marker went green. So, 77, 75, 74. Okay, there's the machine gun turret right there, so... Oh, and there's bots racing around the track. That's funny. <laughs> a robot races. Okay. Um, I want to. I want to get a view without Nick running in there and getting everything going freaking haywire. Hey, Valentine. Do something for you? Yes. I want you to just wait here. Um. What? What? Okay, come here. No, that's not what we want to do. Hey. I'm all ears. Yeah, I want you to just freaking stay Wait here. Wait there. I'll stay put. And you? How you doing, buddy? Um. What the hell? Why can't I tell him? All right. Command. Right. Hey. I want you to just stay. So E will stay, right? And if Hold I stop position. taking my hand off the keyboard, uh, again, if you guys don't know by now, if you if this is like the first video you've seen of mine, I play video games in the dark. Um, this is gaming in the dark. Uh, the reason I do that is because of ambiance. I like it very much, but I'm using a keyboard. I'm not good with the keyboard to start with, but worse than that, I always pull my hand away from the keyboard and then like when I get panicked especially or if I feel rushed or and then I can't get my fingers on the right keys again and I end up doing dumb things and pressing the wrong freaking buttons all the time so um, right now what we're gonna do is I'm hidden I'm gonna come over here and see if we can't snipe some stuff see if I'm relaxed and everything's you know, fine like that, then I don't, I don't press the wrong buttons as often. Okay, I'm not getting anything there. Where was that turret? I saw a freaking turret. There's a triggerman. Maybe I can get him. Let's see. Can I get... Uh, no. Oh, God, the bots are pissed off now. I didn't know they'd get mad. I thought they were just racing. Of them now. Is there a raider around here? Maybe I can get on top of this building. No, the railing is going to prevent me, isn't it? And something detects me. Okay, it's that machine gun turret, maybe. Alright, you need to go away. Like in that. Okay, that's one down. There's a raider. I can't get to that one from here. Oh, but I can shoot that freaking bottle cap mine. Yes, I can. Um, see, see I, again, I took my hand off the freaking keyboard for no apparent reason. All right, maybe a headshot on you? Can we? Can we get it? That, oh, come on! It looks like I'm gonna get a shot. No, what the hell? Or so maybe oh I can't so let's just 
to it like that. That <laughs> worked. I think it worked. Did we get it? We got a danger. Okay. I've got AP now. I think there might be something obscuring the line of fire. Don't quit. Where'd that lift Oh crap, what? Somebody got me with something. Not getting a vats on anybody. Sheesh. Okay, yeah, whatever that is, I can't see it from here. Oh crap! I fell right through. That stinks. That was a pretty good vantage from up there. You know, if I get on top of one of these houses, but there's. I don't think there's a way into any of these. That's boarded up. This one's boarded up. Um, there's no, like, stairways outside or anything. And, uh, you know, I'll be back to you guys in a bit. I think I can handle this for the moment. All right, let's just get back sneaky again and try this one more time. See, that part of the fence is open. And my question is, okay, there's an objective. I have to kill this objective thing, right? There's a 40, 39. And wait, where is that person? They're in that direction. Can I get it, Vats? Eager Ernie. Okay, I need a freaking critical, and I can get Eager Ernie. So... That means I need, like, if I walk, oh, I fall right over this railing. Yeah, it lets me walk up the railing. Where are the bots? They're not racing anymore? Oh, they are racing, okay. Yeah, I want to grind some uh, critical on something. Maybe we'll go for one of these bots. Yeah, the, like the last one. Maybe. Um, no, it's obscured now. I just have a feeling if I shoot one of those bots, it's going to piss off all the bots. And then I'll have, you know, a pack of trouble because that fence is it's got a big hole in it. And they'd be able to just swarm me. And I don't want to fall off here. Okay, Iron Maiden. Hmm. Oh, there's his caver. Can we get a freaking shot on you? 24. I don't know. All I want is one shot should get me a critical. One hit. There we go. Got the sneak attack. Oh, it didn't fill my critical, though. But... I think, maybe... Yeah, 95%. Oh, on the combat inhibitor. Can I get it? Oh, it won't let me do that. Okay, whatever. Did I hit? I, I don't know. What? Who's saying that? There's a raider nearby, isn't there? But I'm not seeing anything. Okay, there's Eager Ernie, and I've got a crit banked now. So, all right. That is what we do. Let's see about this from here. Okay, let's not get caught by the bots. Okay. Now, e 
your Ernie. Oh, not that. We'll press this. Oh, we got an autosave. That's actually smart. So, okay. We'll do this. And critical, and boom, dead. Completed, kill the raiders in East City Downs. And report success. Fan freaking fantastic. All right, that was great, and I'm glad I left those other two behind, because, man, <laughs> you know, I, I just... That that would have been bad if they had gotten involved in all those bots all at once, and, you know... And like the look of that Iron Maiden, it had like fiery crap coming out of its head. Um, so, all right, dog meat, let's go. Come on. Now, at some point, I do want to go back there and just wipe everything out, and I, I want to get that Ernie. But uh, for now, Over here. Oh no! What? What am I doing? Dog meat. Just I, all I said was follow, and then it. Okay, stop. Are you following now? Heads up. All right, good. And Nick, I guess you have to be a little bit of distance away in order to Heads do up. the command. Go on. Moving out. All right. Done and done. Good. All right, so now we got those back with us. We'll go talk with these settlers over here. That should take care of that. I mean, I don't think I even killed all the raiders. I just, but I got the leader. And now I want to see what he's got. <laughs> you know, I want to go back there. Maybe we will just go balls out, go rushing in. You know, I'll pull out the shotgun and, and see see what we can, what damage we can do in there. Uh, but where is our friend here? Okay, lady. Go check that out. Sorry, can't do it. Uh, I'm not trying to tell you to do I anything. I took care of those raiders for you. Really? Well. That's the best news I've heard in a long time. By the way, we've talked about it, and we've decided to support the Minutemen. I think it's worth giving it another chance. That the is... only way things will get better is if we stand together. That is fantastic. Yeah, and we like your shirt a lot. So, um, right on. We wow. well, we've got. Hey there. Been a long time. How you holding up? Nick. Oh hey. Yeah, we're doing all right. It's hard without Gwen, but it gets easier every day. Yeah, that's real good to hear. Well, I, I just wanted to check in. If you ever need anything, you stop by the office. Sure, you got it. Thanks, Nick. How cool is that? Nick knows this girl from somewhere and had something to do with somebody named Gwen. So <laughs> that's pretty neat. Seems to be growing well. All right, so all right, they, okay. We need to get this settlement set up. Um, all right, let's take a quick look. Uh, we got the chemistry bench here. What the hell is that thing doing here? Is that what your parents used to say to you? Oh, and now the other girl doesn't like Nick. Called him a thing. That's pretty rude. You talk to your friend there. All right, and here's the workshop. Okay, they got no defense. They've got food and they've got water and three people. Their happiness is down. They need some defense. Let's just build them a freaking turret real quick here if we can. Uh, we probably can't because... Uh, not structures. Um, you hear what happened to that Abernathy come on. Shut down by oh, come on, I can find it. Defense. Can we... Yeah, we can build it right now. With just the stuff that I am carrying on me. How weird is that? Um, so, yeah. Let's just build one of those. And that will satisfy at least one of their uh, like issues. Great. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I had the mil military grade circuit board and a bunch of miscellaneous stuff. Uh, we just went through and finished clearing out um, Fort Hagen. Like, we went back there after, you know... Uh, no, no, we're not going to do that. We just want to exit out of here like this. Uh, but, yeah, that's why I had that stuff on me. That worked out really well um, to just zip over here straight straight away after finishing looting that stuff. So, right on. They got the cooking station and what... How many... They got 
two mattresses and a bed. Uh, yeah, this place is going to require a lot, a lot of work. Um, we don't need to loot their new Coca-Cola bottles and stuff at the moment. Uh, we'll take the gas canister, as though. As long as you're carrying it. Uh, and they're, they'll have oil because they've got uh, the candles here that we're going to take those. And, um, yeah, I got, I'll got i do all the freaking cleanup here. But for now, I think um, what we're going to do is go back to the... You know, I just I wish we could move workbenches, uh, the workshop. Uh, that would be really nice. But we can't, so no reason to cry about it. Just drop that stuff in there. And, you know, it would, wouldn't be a bad idea to immediately assign... Who is this guy? You're like a little kid. Okay, we won't send the little kid out. Uh, this girl was nice to us. Uh, this girl wasn't so nice. And so, I think what we're going to do is establish a supply line to uh, Sanctuary Hills right now. Uh, with her. Oh, we gotta set up a freaking radio beacon too. But we need we need stuff for that. And in order to get that stuff, we need the supply supply line. So let's uh let's see here. How do we do it again? I used to know how to do this. You press V, hold it, and then we want to do a Q supply line to Sanctuary Hills. Yes. Uh, enter, right? Enter does that. Okay, and off she goes to Sanctuary Hills. Now, I'll need to get her, uh, you know, an appropriate outfit. Why is it machine gun turret? Oh, oh, it wants to know if I want to make a machine gun turret, and I don't. A seaweed. Let's just get rid of that. Now, we can scrap a bunch of stuff here, but I don't think I'm going to have enough stuff for uh, a radio beacon but that is really really what we want right right away is um oh it's under power i think it's been a while since i set one of these up um is that what is this power miscellaneous radio beacon that is a new radio be oh that's a modded one uh now i'm going to use an the standard one because you know what if for whatever reason I have a problem and have to uninstall that mod I would rather not lose the radio beacon um, so we're gonna just set this up like right there for the moment and it needs power um, so let's where, where's power uh, oh it's under here generators and we can do the generator too fan free fantastic look at this guys we're done with that we get the radio beacon going we're gonna get more people here uh, right away and done and done so the settlement all their needs are satisfied at the moment uh, they're obviously gonna need more beds and all that stuff but we've got another settlement set up and Look, uh, let's see what the boundaries look like. This is, you know, not not big. Well, yeah, it's, it extends all the way down to the freaking water line. Look at that. They've got their own little beach here. It's it's really ugly and stuff. And we're gonna have to clean up all this garbage for them. But we'll get them a nice a dead fish. Look, I can I can scrap dead fish. And they give us fertilizer. So how about that? Yeah, and all the seaweed and stuff. So, yeah, we'll get this place, like, all cleaned up. That will give them at least some materials to, to use. Uh, we got the supply line already established. And so, yeah, I'm very excited about seeing what we can do with this new beachfront property. Look at, look at how far it extends. The green area goes all the way past the water line. Down here. Yeah, this is actually quite a large area. Uh, yeah, we'll scrap that. And then comes up here. So I'm just I'm wondering where am I going to put my walls slash fences uh, on this particular property because uh, it's pretty big. We don't necessarily need to go all the way out to the edge. But what I did find is if you don't, 
then you've got people walking on the outside of like we can take parts of these guardrails too that we need the steel very bad that's pretty nice <laughs> we could do the telephone pole too but I, I hate that it leaves the wires hanging up there so we'll just um okay I'm not gonna spend a bunch of time doing this stuff but we can we can get rid of the grass and the brambles and things like that and um, yeah this is nice and look we've got another settler here and we're gonna assign her right away yeah you come over here and you can start harvesting the food sure. like that um, and I don't think I've got any more like anything on me um, food wise uh, a dirt road I could I could do the dirt road I don't think I'm gonna do the dirt road just all right that's that is it I, okay I'll tell you what guys I'm gonna clean this place up uh, they need more beds right now uh, we'll probably have more settlers flowing in uh, because we already got the radio beacon going but I think that is a win so um, guys for now uh, I think we are gonna call it because I really really want to see what we can do with this place and um, yeah nasty we can't see her face right now but that's okay she's working she's busy and she's probably sweaty under there anyway so um, not that we wouldn't mind seeing her like that but um, okay get your minds out of the gutters guys we're going to call it for now please leave your comments likes uh, you know hopes and dreams your fears uh, you know childhood trauma experiences whatever you want to put in the comment section I look forward to hearing from you and uh, we will talk with all of you again very very soon